Hello, this is DC Man with another tutorial. Today we're talking about photogrammetry. Now, what is photogrammetry? Photogrammetry is the process of taking a sequence of photos of an object or a person or whatever um, and creating a 3D model from those photos. This is for one major reason, and that is so you can save time on modeling detail in creating photorealistic textures. Also, if you're not so good at creating textures or modeling or whatnot, it can help in that as well. Okay, so I have um, a few images that I have taken a while ago, um, earlier today, and um, they're just of this little detergent bottle um, and as you can see I just went around it like so outside um, and I went around a few times I took 31 images um, and they're not all that high quality so it's not going to come out very well um, um, so if you scroll down here, you can launch it online. It just takes a lot longer to work. But um, you can download the free PC version. They also have it for uh, iPhone and iPad. Um, so I can't get that because I have an Android phone, which most people do because they're cheaper. But that's just me. Um, yeah, you can launch it or you can download it on PC. Uh, they don't have it for Mac, I don't think, which is kind of odd, but yeah. Um, so once you have that downloaded, just open it up or install it. I'm pretty sure you know how to. If you're watching this, you should. Um, anyway, so what I did is I just click Get Started uh, right here where it says Create New Capture. Um, and then I just went to it. So, this is another one I'm working on. So, let's go to detergent. And that's what I called it. I know I probably spelled it wrong. I don't care. Um, and then I just grabbed all of these images. It's called an image sequence. So, what I did there is I just did Control A, or you can do the same by right clicking. Uh, or, I don't know how you do it, but I've always just done it by Control A and it selects all, um, then you can click open. Then they'll load through if you didn't see, and then you can click create project. Um, you do have to log, you do have to have a Autodesk account, which I believe is free. Well, yeah, I'm not paying anything for it, so it's free. Um, and right here, I'm just gonna say test cat. You already there. Oh, can't spell. Um, and then I'm just gonna say test, comma, uh, YouTube. And then this is a container. Oh, I didn't know they had this section. Uh, containers. Um, and then description. Test capture for YouTube. You don't really. Have to put you have to fill in these, you have to fill in everything, um, but you don't have to make it legit or anything. Um, now, you, this is the important thing you can, if it's a lot of images and it, it's going to take a long time, you probably just going to want to email it to you. Um, but if you know you don't need, if it's not a big file or you just have time on your hands, you can just click wait which I'm going to do and I'll be back when it's done it takes about 20 minutes maybe I don't know so I'll be right back okay so what I did here was I, I the one that's installed on my computer I don't know if it's just me but it wasn't working all oh so well 
So, so I just did the same thing, but I put it on my uh, my computer. I mean, uh, online. Yeah. Um, so how I did that was I just went, uh, go to the website. There we go. So I went to their website and I just said launch online. Um, and it loaded up this. And then I, I went to open and it automatically uploads what you already had. Um, but I'll just show you with another one that I did, uh, or this one actually I can do. So I just selected it and opened it. Um, Come on. Okay, so here it is. Now what I can do is I can export OBJ, which is just a object file, and I'll download it. I I went to Blender. Now that you're in here, you're just going to delete that. Um, you don't have to use Blender. You can use any uh, 3D modeling software like Blender because it's free. Uh, so you click File, Import, OBJ. I have it right here. And then Sculpt.OBJ. I double clicked on it. And now uh, let's click here, Texture. And right now the orientation's a little off. And there you have it. Now I know it looks really, really crappy. That is just because my camera sucks. Um, but if you think about it, that is pretty damn cool. Uh, anyway, see you guys next time. Bye.